So, we're getting back to Pony. Good! We're getting a reference to the fact Daring Don't was a thing. Okay, good. There's no knives around to tempt me with suicide. <laughs> okay, I may have issues with the episode. And, you know, that doesn't mean this episode's gonna be bad. And I wouldn't say that one was bad more than just really, really stupid. But, we got a convention. That's good. That's good. Um, and also, we did reference an episode I didn't hate, even if it did have its own issues. Griffin Stone. So, let's settle on in and see where this rabbit hole takes us. Ah, nerd love. Here we see, in the, wi in the wilds of the convention center, the mating ritual of the geek. <laughs> uh, Alright, so is this guy just going to be a good friend, or is he going to be an annoyance? Let's find out. Oh, he's that kind of fan, the one that hates everything done after a certain point because it's totally not canon because it doesn't fit their idea. Eh, it's happened before, and for all we know, there might be a good reason. Oh, wait, no, now I think about it, there wouldn't be a good reason, because apparently everything Daring Don't Do writes is real. Does he not know this? <laughs> and this, ladies and gentlemen, is why you do not have a character in your universe that was previously fictional to the universe become real without some weird spell or something. <sighs> I hurt. I hurt. Oh, why did they have to make Daring Don't? Why? <sighs> I have to admit, watching this guy get all huffy about this book series is satisfying. Yes, I can feel your nerd rage. Let it flow through you. You know, I could point out how silly it is for him to be telling Dash that, but I do have to wonder, for him to think that the later books are impossible, what must she have been doing? Dark Abyss, was she sprouting fingers like Lyra or something? <laughs> uh, but yeah, I'm still back on how does he not... No, this is real, and also one could argue why doesn't he know who Rainbow Dash is, but apparently no one knows anything in this world. Even bookworms like Twilight need to be told about important historical events. Alright, I'm at the part where she whisks Rainbow Dash away, I'm gonna call it not everything she's done is real. I'm gonna call it now. Some of them she made up. Eh, okay, I was wrong. Huh. Well, this is something I hadn't considered. Is Cavaleron aware that Daring Do writes her adventures as novels? Uh. Hey, what do you know? We brought back Daring Do as an actual pony, and it's stupid! <laughs> you know, you may not be a knife, but you might work. Nope, just hurts a bit. Why, when he escaped, didn't they try to stop him? Hmm. So apparently to convince someone something is real, you need giant lizard monster. Of course, this ignores the fact that this world has manticores, minotaurs, and other such assorted beasts of doom. Though, then again, the minotaurs do seem to be civilized. But you get what I mean. There's lots of scary things. Oh, hydras. Yes, hydras. And 
bug bears that are apparently giant panda bugs. Hmm. But, yeah, it's... Hmm. We'll never make it in time! Let's stand around talking about how we won't make it! Ah! <laughs> Don't get me wrong, I'm all for nefarious people not getting hold of priceless artifacts, but... Um... Is this thing magic? Did any did we ever get told it was magic? If we did, I forgot. But otherwise, it's not worth this much. I'm kind of surprised he hasn't figured out it's AK Yearling yet. Or is that going to be the thing he says at the end? Is like, oh, you're AK Yearling. Hmm. I have itchy face. So that seems to be a no on him figuring it out. And, I have to say, You have failed me, my apprentice. You have turned from your anger. Now, young pony, you will die. Okay, there, now that I've gotten my referencing out of the way. Eh, uh, well, we at least did one thing. We did an okay lesson. Did it better than, uh, I know Dark Abyss. What was Mod's episode again? I can't remember the name. The first episode. Actually, no, I think it was just Mod Pie. But, yeah. Kind of the same lesson, but... Or at least a similar lesson, but done much better. But, yeah. I mean, don't get me wrong. It, Like Daring Don't, it had its points. I am capable of watching this again, but... Like Daring Don't, I'm just going to sit there and point out everything that bugs me. Aside from the fundamental issue of Daring Do being an actual pony. <clears throat> Excuse me. Pony. <clears throat> the heck was that? So. Eh. But. It was pony. There, there was pony. Though I find it rather apparent there was no violence. I know it's My Little Pony, but we've had violence in the past. And that might have uh, skipped over the, oh, it's just the play actors, it's just the play actors. If somebody actually roughed him up, he might have been able to get over that crap faster. So, um, see you very soon, because it's Friday it's a bit after 12 a.m. Friday. Starting off on the late foot again. <laughs>